<laughs> hey guys, cool bond we're back. I'm Rick. Shane. Eric. Aaron. And I'm Kevin. And this is Mob Psycho 100. Mob Psycho. Last time. Well, Ritsu is falling fast to the dark side. He's, yes. in power. he's enjoying his relationship with Dimple, even though he knows he's being somewhat used. Dimple's back, also. Yeah, yeah Dimple's he did not back. He built himself back, just doesn't have a whole lot of power left. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But good for him. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, the most interesting to me is just his brother showing up at the end, who he's not, nowhere close to that power level. I don't think he's anywhere close to the guy with the wig. No, he's not. He's so not that's that's why I said he's nowhere terrible. close. Yeah. And uh, the student council president got the shit kicked out of him. He did. Yeah. Yes. Pretty cathartic. But Taro, Taro does seem like he's kind of changed a little bit, doesn't he? Yeah. Mm-hmm. He's like, you know, we should. I was behind you too, man. You shouldn't do that. God, kick your ass. Turn you naked, throw you in the sky. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see more from the body improvement club. Me too. Me too. Well, let's see what we have this time. I like how they're standing up for the, the one guy that was getting framed. I love all the yeah. schools are named after food. You're doing this again? Unless, of course, you're just not saying anything to trick me. No, there really are not been any. So, are the two nope. of you on a date? <laughs> well, well, this guy seems face. pretty unique. Cool if I borrow him for a bit? Uh, oh, did he go get him? Mm. Someone's fighting under my name? He's back that way. <laughs> you should go and take a look for yourself. He's like eight feet tall. It's like a British guard. <laughs> right? It's you. It's you. What are you doing, Ritsu? Shige. Must be his younger brother. Who's this kid? Did you do all this? Yes, I'm responsible. Uh, uh, Watching two siblings fight isn't exactly the classiest thing to do. Good man. I'd watch. No way. Come on, you're just kidding, right? See, I finally obtained psychic powers. Uh. Whoa, Ritsu, what do you think you're doing? Not another word, Dimple. I'm not hanging around for a battle I know you'll lose! <laughs> Dimple? Uh, he Whatever, saw. I don't need him. I've got the hang of it now. Do you? Look, if something's bothering you... What are you doing, man? You did it! You've wanted them for so long, you'd cry your eyes out because you couldn't bend spoons. Who would have thought that now? The situation hadn't changed until recently. Because you had them, I'd always admired you, brother. Really? You're making me blush. (laughs) But that was just a big misunderstanding. It was? More than anything, I was scared of you. I never knew what you might do if you got stressed out. We could never even have a fight as brothers. So I did my best to stay out of your way and not cause any trouble between us. I tried so hard for so long. You never worked hard in your life, so why? The delusional admiration is gone. I've lost all interest in our relationship. So this buddy-buddy act of ours ends now. That's all just a lie. I want you to face me! Hit me with the full force of your powers! But I guess part of what you said is true. I am your brother. I have to help take care of you. I'm terribly sorry that my little brother hurt you. He lost his temper, that's all. Huh? What did you say? You idiot! Think that's enough to be forgiven to you? You need to grovel down on your knees first! Grovel? Okay. You got your ass beat. Why would you do that? What do you think you're you're doing? doing? There isn't any use in trying to get rid of me. I mean, we're brothers. Not while I was here, I'd observe. What are you, an idiot? Hurry up and bring him here. Just in case, send a photo. It'd be a real pain in the ass if you brought back the wrong brat. Got it. That's the voice actor for Shigeo Kageyama. Um, like I said, oof. confirms the Awakening Ooh. Lab's data. The Awakening Lab? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Whoa! That's pretty cool. Now this. Like that Jedi you were telling us about. It's like Virgil. Oh, no. No fooling around. I got it. I got it. Let's get this wrapped up. The tables have turned. Quite <laughs> deep poison. There's been enough violence. Now just who the hell do you think you are? I just got your ass kicked in doors Only again. Only the strongest can give out orders like that. Cool. It's like into the Spider Verse. You're exactly right. Let go. Oh, oh me geez. too. Who the, who the hell are you? You guys figure that if you're strong at fighting, you can rule your school and turfs, right? But this guy's on a completely different level. So I'm not your brother. He's our target. You can't. Yeah! That's our business. What? Jeez. He's dead. Wait, I got a bad feeling. Oh, no shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. <coughs> Pathetic. My little brother. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Yeesh. Tall guy, what's with that angry stare, huh? 
It wasn't angry. Grovel and apologize to me. <laughs> we're reviewing the scene you were playing out earlier. If you don't grovel, I'll kill you, little punks. <laughs> uh, what a sight to behold! Look at all you pathetic dipshits! Let this be a lesson for those who think they're badasses. <laughs> Reach! It's your brother! Oh. Oh. oh shit! Oh my gosh! You too, brat? Let go of my brother, or you'll regret it. <laughs> I'm Ooh. so glad he can go all out. Go all out, Mob. Come on. I'm not supposed to use these powers against others. Come on, Mob. But this is different. It's different. It is different. Yes! I remember now. He's that adult Esper I noticed. Luckily, there are ways to deal with little Esper brats like you! <laughs> Telekinetic Helix! Helix! Who's that? Now cry. Oh. Oh. I can't exhale or inhale. My stomach is burning. You're gonna protect your little brother, right? Oh, oh. Holy crap! Come on, Mob. Leave him alone. Climb yeah, together. Dimple, save the day. Just feed this kid. Him, please. Just take me! That's what you wanted, right? What's with that look on your face? Think I'll take this opportunity to wipe it off! Is that other thing yeah. inside of mom? Oh his my brother. gosh! This is the first time this has happened while I'm still conscious. Oh, oh shit. Can you feel it? Rage and burning in me. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's super saiyan! <laughs> Jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Holy shit, the animation. Don't you ever show your face in front of us again. Oh. 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 What? It's nothing. How can it have no effect this time? Oh, oh shit. Oh, my gosh. It's me you're striking him. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god. Gorgeous, gorgeous <laughs> animation, man. Okay. Dang. Dang. Oh, gosh. Okay. This is the guy from Goonies. Yeah. <laughs> Energy He's back. Bomb. He's back. Clothesline. CJ! There's oh, Dembo. He fall over. Oh, I know. Reinforcements! Karu. Ah! Body club. Damn it. Body club would be awesome. Rat. Yeah. <laughs> All the thugs. Can't believe like that exists. Get the hell out of here. Hey, look at that. It's it's a white t-shirt. Ah. Uh, see? White t-shirt. Voice of brother. He's the shadow leader oh in some middle gosh. school. Oh my gosh. That's why his name's White T. <laughs> yeah. If you're not giving up, I'll end it. Oh. The next move will be the last. Take this, rat! Is he insult? Just kidding. Oh! What's that? Mace? What happened? So I'm gonna have to make you disappear. Crap, We're back in. Oh. It's oh. Possible. Get him, Mom. He's not conscious. <laughs> Why is he just standing there? I don't know. He's still at 100. He's unconscious. You're from Black Vinegar Middle School. I can't believe someone was able to push him over the edge like that. He left and took Ritsu with him. <laughs> Damn it! This is rock salt from the Himalayas. A fortune teller said there was something dense weighing down on them. So they just told her that and took the money? Hell, you're responsible. <laughs> I know just what to do. Ghosts and spirits are completely powerless against salt. First, we'll weaken them with a the rock salt powder. Phase two. We'll use the hard edges of the rock salt to do a massage to loosen up your tense muscles and improve your blood flow. Shane, is this like that massage in Fiji? It was worse. <laughs> Such a wonderful smell! Aroma Runaway Express! <laughs> <laughs> Goodness, I feel so much younger. Oh, That's oh. an added bonus. Oh, I'm so glad there was no actual spirit to deal with. God, you're finally awake. I was worried. Why were you there with Ritsu? It's a long story. Oh, 
Are you to blame for all this? Yeah. <laughs> it's Danny. I don't know who those guys are! He doesn't, but I do. They've been trying to follow me around for a few years now. A few years? It's an organization called CLAW, formed by dangerous espers. And there are over a hundred who are actively Man. involved. There are plenty of facilities across the world that are researching ways to manufacture psychic powers. Hmm. They take child espers who have yet to mature, brainwash them, and raise them as soldiers. They aren't as powerful as us naturals, but if you underestimate them, their sheer numbers will crush you. I'm gonna go save him. Oh. Do you have a death wish? Then calm down and think. I think I can win. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I just remembered! There's a research facility where people like you are gathering. Maybe we should check it out. But I have a bad feeling about this. All right, we got a team. How could they do this? That to guy was. <laughs> it drives me crazy. <laughs> I love it. it. Looks like they're unconscious, but not dead. Well, they're that. not dead. Can we do that? Can be bald or have that hair? That hair for sure. So they didn't kill him. Did you sell Ritsu Kageyama's personal information to Claw? You must be mistaken. The one I invited here was a kid named Shigeo Kageyama. You're wrong. That's me. It, it can't be. Where are the other kids? They were kidnapped. Is all of this my fault? Who are you guys, anyway? Uh. <laughs> That's the most oh. psychic ability he's ever seen. Yeah. It's done? Yeah. Wait, or no, this. keep still going. Okay. Run, wizard, run. Damn. Uh, yeah. They really need to not have like those one brothers, like leave one brother so they can like, communicate. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, with their. With their yeah. <laughs> Shit got real fast. It did. I, the story really kicked in like the last yeah. couple episodes and I've been loving it. Best episode of this series of four. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I mean, every every other fight, it's just been like, well, yeah, mom's way better. But here I'm like, I, it seems like he could be, but he just but, doesn't have the experience. Yeah, but is yeah. he? I think he's more powerful. He just doesn't I have just those don't know. I think moves. this guy just knows more about fighting. Mob's yeah. not a yeah, fighter, yeah. really. Is it Mob, though? That's true. We've talked about that in the past. <laughs> mob mob wasn't winning. It wasn't until the 100% yeah. conscious, unconscious -y thing took over. But Mob wasn't. But Mob was conscious. Yeah, he was conscious. Yeah. He, he was. So he didn't black out. No. That was the first time of him being conscious in this yeah. happening. You know what I love though? I love that the 100 counter didn't start going crazy until they hit his brother. Yeah, yeah. he yeah. was getting his ass kicked so much, <laughs> but it was like ah, as long as it's not hitting Ritsu. But mm -hmm. he hit Ritsu once. <laughs> loved it so much. Yeah, yeah that was cool. That was so cool. That was a funny noise you just made. <laughs> it was great. It's such oh, high pitch. Oh. <laughs> so Ritsu was trying to talk to Mob all those times because Ritsu needed to talk. Yeah. Not because Mob needed to yeah. talk. Yeah. I, I don't think Ritsu was being completely truthful when he was saying like how much he didn't care for Mob. Yeah. I Wait, think it, that was just like the grief and the frustration. That I've, I've lost interest in this relationship, yeah. that whole thing. I think yeah. that he was just like, it was just feeling the negative, the negative speed force, you know? Yeah. He's just feeling that. But uh, I think that the truth is, you know, I think it's, there's definitely some, some truth there, but it's more, probably more in the middle. But yeah, Mob's, it'd be like your sibling was Psyduck. You yeah. just couldn't upset them. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <right>? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Pikachu. Yeah, that was a, that was kind of like a demoralizing speech yeah. until the guy showed up and it looked like that wasn't the case. I don't know why Teru like he just dropped him off and left. I'd have been standing around that corner seeing what was gonna happen. Well, he said yeah. like you know it's not really polite to watch siblings fight yeah. stuff. He was being decent. We didn't know it was a sibling at the time. There's nothing decent about that. Yeah, he have said you seen that. his hair. Yeah, he, he said that. he said about the yeah. siblings at that moment. I think right. Not yeah. when he yeah. dropped off uh, Mob. Yeah, but when he realizes, like, it's yeah, you, brother. Yeah. And he's like, ah, uh, I should get out of here. Yeah, yeah. he said, it's not polite to watch it. He said siblings. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I'd watch it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, everyone else is standing there I mean, there was, there was a bunch of, like... They're not polite. Well, of course, they didn't know about that, that guy in the hoodie either. What was Otherwise, he, his name was uh, Koyama. Koyama. I don't think they said it, but it was in the subtitle. Right? Yeah. yeah. And Sakurai yeah. was the guy on the phone. Mm -hmm. Sakurai. Sakurai. Yeah. Who's the guy on the phone, that was... Interesting. He's basically Virgil. Yeah, yeah using the cool. sword and telekinesis and stuff. So this is called the the claw. The claw. And they they use some kind of artificial means of having psychic powers. Is that what they say? They yeah, take this. young espers who aren't matured yet and brainwash them. Okay. But they said it's not like they're naturals like us. Yeah. Well, they said they make. Uh, I think they said they use it to make soldiers. Right? Yeah. Like they make Esper soldiers that aren't natural by using the actual weak Espers and utilizing them somehow, right? Yeah. Where does the brainwashing come in? 
Is that well, the young espers or on the soldiers? I'm not sure. I, I think know. it's a process. We saw I, those tanks. They they said they had a specific method of manufacturing the psychic yeah. abilities. So they brainwash so, the young espers, utilize the tr- information they get from them, and then manufacture it into like a super. Maybe they do something I think, I think, like how Dimple I think was just, able to unlock a potential or uh, be a focus for. For uh, Retso. Maybe. Maybe some similar I, I took it to be that they got these young espers, they did their psychic manufacturing thing to make them stronger, then they brainwashed them so that they were their soldiers. So what, what I took it as. Because mm-hmm. they're taking these kids, they're not willing participants. Yeah. I think that's what the brainwashing is for. Okay, but there was a distinction about they're not natural like us. So I would no. imagine that the espers were natural. They're just enhancing their power? Or... I think so. Okay. Or taking kids that have, like the one girl, she... she think she has some kind of ESP or something like that. Like, they could take someone like that and just crank up their power. Their sheer numbers will crush you. Okay. So, there we go. so the kids are, are the soldiers. So it's like young espers, like, maybe on the level of... Well, those guys yeah. they took from the, the, one, the guys. one study group, right? Yeah. But the, those guys the are... The random fire guy yeah. and the mind reader people. So but, you take them, brainwash them, and somehow mature them into soldiers, but they're going to be weaker than if they just naturally yeah. came to their... Yeah. Uh, Came into their own. Through their own maturity or whatever. Yeah. Okay. I was just trying to find, like, what's the line, what's the distinction when they say us naturals versus the other? Well, I wonder if, like, they put them in those vats and use science to increase Pu- their to stuff. push them further and stuff. Yeah. Is it a coincidence that both of those guys had, like, some kind of big scar on their face? I don't know. I mean, we need to see more, I guess. But yeah. Maybe yeah. there's something to do with some kind of, like, surgical thing or something. I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't look like a surgical scar, but still. No. Like they both had big giant scars on their faces. So maybe because they're supposed to be like dangerous. Maybe. maybe. They needed a scar. Fighters guard. scars. Huh? So they needed a scars guard. So, where does Inspector Gadget fit in all this? Doctor Claw. Yeah. I don't know if we're gonna go with Doctor Claw or the Claw. I thought we were gonna only go with Claw. I think it was. Well, there's the Claw from Line of Liar, right? It's the Claw. Yeah, that's what I was thinking about. <laughs> yeah. I'm a monster. Right. Yeah. No. It's a hook, but yeah. It could be claw. It's it could be You can claw that. Yeah. Yeah. What about that sleep spray he used was? Yeah, the mace kind of stuff. If it was, like, science for psychics, or if it was just sleep spray? <laughs> I think it was just sleep spray. Sleep powder, man. I hate sleep powder. Sleep powder. Like in Pokemon, person. when someone uses sleep powder on you, it's such yeah. a bitch move, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he, used po- he used to use poison powder. University of Nicaragua is a bitch like move. Like, my... My Pokemon's sitting there sleeping, the other one just beating on you. Yep. I hate it. You'd think they'd wake up. I yeah. know. You would think. <laughs> like anesthesia. That's what it is. Do that with leech seed. I knew you were going to fucking say that. Yeah. Poison powder or sleep powder with leech seed. It's great. I know. It's great. What I love doing is putting a Snorlax to sleep. <laughs> like, if, like something that would rest, that would you go to sleep, put it to sleep, and then it, and you beat on it, and then it wakes up, and then it puts itself to sleep because it's hurt. <laughs> and then you beat on the table. <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> Whole time was leech seeded, you're just getting more health. Uh, great, Calvin, great. I, uh, Yo, my ear. <laughs> I, again, the big hair is just so visually pleasing to me. Yeah, I, I love it. Like, I love it. It's so funny. It's like it's a funny. It's like a British guard, you know, with yeah. The, yeah. This, those huge helmets or whatever. There's just something about it that's just, like, he's so serious. <laughs> like, he's wearing this giant wig. Yeah. That's why I love the clash. Like, I, I love like almost the clashing tones to it. They, they <laughs> contrast each other really sure. well. I loved uh, the salt little thing yeah. with the. Uh, oh, yeah. The salt Reagan. Massage. With Reagan. The Roma Runaway Express! Yeah. <laughs> and he's like, it's like, well, <laughs> then we'll use the edge. I just, I always love whenever he's doing something. Yeah. I like how he's like, they just told you it was all this way from the spirit and then left it? How oh, irresponsible. Yeah. You know, they didn't take the money and make them feel better. Right. He's they like, took his money. Yeah, he's like, you gotta make them feel better. And then yeah. they'll come back one more. Yeah. It's At great. the very least, he's giving them a massage. So yeah, they yeah. feel better. It's, it's a service. He's Which, at least easing their mind. Yeah. Yeah. Which, Which is the service that he provides. Costs more in that world then he's charging for all we True. Yeah. yeah. Well, he's about the art of conning, too. No, I imagine the massage would be less than him doing some kind of spiritual yeah. massage. I would imagine, but maybe not. You know, you get a $50 massage, this is $150. <laughs> <laughs> Got rid of the spirits. If you ever have it happen again, come back. Let me know. Yeah, it's not just a massage to relax your muscles. Sometimes spirits are known to come back every two to three months. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Especially after any hard labor. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the That's white that. tea poison reveal was funny. Yeah. Like, oh, okay. It's because he had a white shirt on at yeah. one point. I was trying to figure out how they got that, but yeah, that makes perfect sense now. I wonder if that Look at works shirt. in It's a white tea. tea. I wonder if that works in Japanese. I don't. I, I, I would assume so, right? Like a t-shirt. 
I don't know. Maybe it is, he's not named White Tea Poison. Maybe it's something else. Something else. Another word. Yeah. Imagine if they... It landed pretty well for in the English tub. It did. Yeah. yeah. It was really good. You just listen to music. You just listen to the white tees. Yeah. Like on like a Walkman. Yeah. Like uh, that happens sometimes. Like in Dragon Ball Super, there was a character who in Japanese his name is like it means disappointment, and like they scream ah the disappointment, you know, <laughs> or something like that. But it doesn't really work in the English. Yeah. No. Huh. You don't want us to name a guy disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I would. Disappointed. <laughs> so like in that they're all yelling like. Like they're yelling yeah. his name, yeah. but then they come back to the English dub, and for whatever re- random reason, they just go disappointment. <laughs> well, no, they just say his name. Oh, okay. Yeah, they just say yeah. the name. Oh, okay. Like it's like you know, it's like if Goku meant disappointment, they just say Goku. They don't say the Japanese sure. word for disappointment. You know. I think that's all I have. It's a great episode. It's I mean, a really good fight scene. It was really hyped. Yeah, I love the animation. I'm really getting into the story. Like, yeah, really am. Yeah. At first, I was like, I'm enjoying the show, and the story is a byproduct. Yeah. That's kind of how I felt. Yeah. You know. It's kind of how I thought it might go, where his brother might turn the evil one. But it's happening way faster, and there's yeah. many more folds than I anticipated. Yeah. 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 And I'll, okay. I, I, was, I enjoyed this episode a lot. Like, a lot of this, I've been like, it's been all right. Yeah. But, like, this one was like, oh, dude, he's fighting this guy. Yeah. Maybe he can be him. Maybe he can't. What's going on here? I liked it. Yeah. I was like, interested. Now there's this whole shadow organization. Instead yeah. of, like, I like it when he's not fighting anybody, because every time he fought something, he was just like, yeah. And I was like, oh, okay. And now the four of them are going to go fight this organization. Yeah. Do you think uh, Regan's going to get on this? I hope so, because I could use his confidence. We have, like, a little bit of a team. And I would love for them to use the claw technology to, yes. to give him psychic powers. Or Regan. Dimple just yes. goes inside of him and unlocks the ones he had all along. I don't want Regan with those silly I don't think blocks on his face. What? They went a little, like... No. There, uh, there was one spot I did, like, with uh, Retsu. Okay. Where he said, like, you know, you never had to work a day in your life. I thought that was a, it's a pretty cool contrast to, like, you know, One Punch Man, which can feel similar. It's like, well, this guy will never lose. But I, I do feel like Saitama worked and earned his power where Mob just kind of seemed to be born with it, where it's natural, you know? Yeah. yeah. Where Saitama was this man, and then he did the Saitama workout, well, One Punch workout. Yeah. <laughs> and, 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 like, you know, at the very least, he's gotten to that level on his own yeah. back, you know? So I thought it was interesting that his brother was like, never had to work for this, you know? And he's, he has had to work for it, so... But he's had to work for so much else. Yeah. Like he his, has a job. His schooling and... He has a job. We also have the, like, is there, a, is there something else in him, too, you know? Yeah. Like, he didn't have to work for that, but he come at a cost. Yeah. And, and the Body Improvement Club. He's been working on that. Yes, he has. Yes, he has. Lots of work. Can't wait. Had. See more. See more of the Body Improvement Club. He just left it with his mind. Flex. Flex. Oh, my God. All right, all right. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Oh, that go on sorry. for us. We appreciate, we love you. If you want to see the full length version of this, go to patreon.com slash blindwave. Make sure you go there and check out early access as well for this and full length for this and everything else that we do. That's this. not. It's the only way to go 100. And this. this. <laughs>